All right, guys, really quick, a little video about some of my favorite photo that I took in. Uh, this was in Kokomo Beach in Curacao in the Caribbean. I've always heard, you know, this song, you know, uh, you know, there's a place called Kokomo. That's where you want to go. Well, here it is. So um, I was, you know, they have this sort of... Uh, you know, playground for kids here, and the sun was pretty high. This is, I, t I took so many photos. This is the the one that I uh, like the most, so I tried with different characters. And so the sun was pretty high on this one. Then the sun got lower on this one with these two beautiful ladies, and then there was this other lady that was there. The sun was really at the horizon, and then no one was there. So I tried different things. So let's see here. I'm going to use my signature presets, which you can get for free if you click. I mean, some of them for free if you click the link on Messenger right below this video. You just have to be logged into Facebook and you can get them right away. I'm going to try on this one. I'm going to go crazy. I'm going to go sunset, sunset, linear, dark, something like this. One click and boom. Look at that. It's crazy. It's a little over the top, so I'm going to lower down the saturation. Don't need to be so much saturated. Uh, I think on this one, you see, I don't like when there is too much blue in the sky. Remember, uh, I'm going to take the, the, this little spot out. I like, uh, you know, a, a, a preset is only a starting point. I think I'm going to use the little gradient here. I have a little gradient in my signature preset. I'm going to add a little more blue. There was already some blue there, but I want to get more blue. Uh, let's see, that's too much blue. You got to be very subtle because if you add too much color that was not there, you can really see it afterwards. I just wanted to add a little bit more, but because there's a bit of a lag, yeah, that's too much of a difference. You see, I'm going to back it down. I just wanted to add a bit more blue. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, on this one, I'm just going to make this, that's all right. I'm going to take my radial circle. If you use my preset, you will see you have to click. There is circles. You have to put this one over the sun. And then you have to go here to range mask if you've got, you don't have to do that as an optional step, but if you have Lightroom CC, the, the latest, and you have this new beautiful luminance slider, you can use that and you move this to the right. Then this way, the, whatever it's doing on the sun is, you see, it's, it's check out the difference. See how the, the color of the sun is spinning over on the boy and everything. And if I do that, it's it's more around the sun because it creates a, it creates a mask. So if you press the option key, you can even see what the mask looks like, which is really cool. So uh, black conceals white reveals. So the black, see the boy is black, so he's not going to get influenced by that radial circle. So if yeah, if you want to get the signature preset, just download it here it's for free, and you can get it. We have a new way to deliver the files to you through Messenger. It's much faster. You just click and you get the files. Okay, and maybe this one I'm going to crop. But before I do that, I'm going to select all and I'm going to synchronize what I did on this one on the other ones because I think it will do most of the heavy lifting. So let's click on this one. Uh, this one, the sun was coming down a little bit. Again, the preset is just a starting point. Like I find this one really lacks of contrast and uh, maybe add a bit more contrast on this one. Maybe add a bit of vibrance. I didn't add any vibrance on the other one because it was so bright. Uh, and then let's say this one. I love to take photos when the sun is right at the horizon and uh, the two pretty girls left and I got an old lady that came, but you know, that's life. But she was had an interesting hat. So that's kind of cool. And then the last one is this one. So I always work like this with preset. It goes really fast, you know. So which one do I like the most? I'm gonna press N. N is gonna put me into survey mode. Okay, shift tab to go really full screen. And I can see all the photos, which one I think will do best on 500px. Uh, I think the one that's going to do best is this one, is the one of the boy, because the, one, the, the expression of the boy is cool, but uh, the I don't like so much the water down here on this one. It's a bit blurry because it's lagging. So I think I'm going to crop this one. So let me go back on this, Shift tab to go back, and I'm just going to use this one. I'm just going to crop it. I don't want to distract it with something else, so I'm just going to come here and cut this and then I'm going to post this on 500px and I'm going to go get, uh, you know, a 95.7 reward, be on the homepage of 500px, you know, <laughs> I hope, maybe not. Uh, you know, usually I don't like photos when the sun is too high, but in this one, because of the boy was so awesome, I think it works really the best. Uh, you know, I think I like more the light here, you know, when there was this lady there, but... Uh, 
I don't know, the the fact that the boy is there. I see, for me, what makes a really cool photo is having like a foreground, a background, and a middle ground. And I think, you know, he is just so awesome, you know, with the way he, uh, he does with his arms. It's just more cute. And voila, so that's just, you know, sharing some of the little tricks. Download my signature presets uh, right down below. I hope you like this, guys. See you in another video.